probability calculations. And this part here, we're going to talk about what is called equally likely outcomes. And the first two images you can see here have what are called equally likely outcomes. Because this dice has the numbers 1 to 6. And each number has an equally likely chance of occurring. Because there's only one of each number on the dice. The same for the coin. You've got heads or tails. And both of those have an equally likely chance of occurring or happening. Okay. The third one this um, loaded dice is different it doesn't have equally it doesn't have an equally likely chance of things occurring the reason for this is we actually have two sixes so the sixes actually have a better chance of happening than I guess whatever numbers are on this dice what we're going to say is that usually when you have things such as coins or dice or anything like that usually these represent equally likely outcomes something that is in the real world such as sporting events horse races and other things that we bet money on these outcomes are not equally likely since one team might be better than another or maybe one horse is better than another 